Are we gonna eat with hands? Yes. Seriously, what a place and today I'm gonna try Sri Lankan food for the first time and I'm very excited about it because I've never tried it and I have really high expectations because Sri Lanka seems like a place uh, where they don't have like imported products they cook with local stuff they sell local stuff and I appreciate it a lot seriously so it's gonna be interesting journey in Sri Lankan food. I'm in Colombo and now we're going to some local cafe named uh, Curry Pot. They are making curry there, uh, rice with some dishes on the side, with some meat, with some wages, and of course, tuk tuk drivers are right here. Thank you. Here. Thank you. No, thank you. Annoying. And today I want to figure out what the difference between Sri Lankan food and Indian food and any Asian food because all of them the core is quite similar uh, everywhere they have this uh, thin type of bread everywhere they have rice everywhere they have curry but uh, all over the Asia they are different like very different they use different spices so let's see if I would like Sri Lankan curry yeah I like Indian curry I like Thai curry let's see what Sri Lanka have and yeah this place looks very authentic I would say and we are right next to the ocean and it's our place for today Let's for go. today's breakfast yeah. yeah lunch almost brunch brunch yeah so here we are yeah very everything local is so good. everything and the smell is so good you just don't feel it like i feel it now are we gonna eat with hands yes how it should be and we're gonna stay in the line and choose our dishes let's go yeah. looks like a busy place and it's very cheap yeah it's very affordable like one dish is 60 600 600 rupees. something yeah. 600 something rupees which is uh, a little bit over two dollars two dollars for a big plate of curry let's see what they have looks like we're standing in the line here we can already check out what the brother is eating and he looks like a professional here watch and learn how it's done right there <laughs> so not sure what i'm gonna get looks like they have some chicken some fish yeah. let's explore a bit so basically they have tons of different pots you want to take over I will stand in line for you. What is it? It's a mutton. Lamb. It's mutton. Yes. Lamb. And yeah, this? Prawn, fish. Fish. Calamari and chicken. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, prawns? Yeah. yeah, let's do prawns. Yeah. Want some yeah. rice? No, enough. enough. You're, you're hanging in there with him. <laughs> A couple of prawns, little prawns. Some prawns. That beans? Yeah. Nice. And what is that? Do you know? 
It's a potato, yeah? No, not potato. No, golden apple. Oh, the golden yeah. apple. Golden apple. Wow. Cool. All right. Do you want my chicken? Yes. <laughs> Easily sold. Yes. All right. Can I have an egg on the side? What's up? Egg. What's sure, up? yeah. Uh, no. Asking no. if she can have an egg. Chili <laughs> eggs? No. Uh, egg. No. no. This is spicy. Uh, what is it? Omelette. Omelette. Yeah. Anyone omelette? There you go. <laughs> nice. Uh, that's all, yeah. Uh, maybe later. Yeah. Thank you. How much is for for all? Hmm? One thousand Okay. Lisa Chaika. <laughs> Lisa Chaika. Chaika, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Uh, coins. We will share. We can share. I'll get my own. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I, I chose the most expensive items. How much is it? Uh, yes. One thousand something. <laughs> wow. Wow. There we go. Very impressive portion. Very impressive food. Okay, come. And it smells so good. So, this beautiful plate and I'm gonna eat it with my hands, how it should be. Yeah, then you have a really nice amount of food too. And I'm satisfied with my plate. And let's try something. So, let's mix it up first a little bit. So, we have banana leaves.
and the browns. The browns is again in a, some kind of yellow yellow sauce. Um, let's feel it. So juicy. Really. Wow. Hard to feel because it's so juicy. Sauces everywhere. Mm. Really flavory. Mm. It's like if you close your eyes, you can't even understand that it's brown because it's very flavory. Like brown in a sauce for chicken, something like that. I actually like eating with hands. You can easily mix up all sauces. And, uh, it takes much more time so you can enjoy your meal and not over eat. That's nice. Mm, I like the omelette. And banana leaf. So good. Okay, I'm let's. Dying. It's so spicy. Uh, my items are less spicy. Oh my god. I think. I think this might be the spiciest food I've even eaten in years. Maybe you're just sensitive. Yes, I'm just. Uh, What happened, kid? I ate something from your plate and now I'm dying. Hmm. Well, maybe you're just sensitive today. <laughs> this, this shit is sensitive. This shit is crazy I had here. I don't know what I had, but some type of spicy mutton hell. Something from hell. Yeah, mutton from hell. You should have sticked to that chicken. Yeah. It will go away. It will go away. Let's go buy you some milk. Some spicy mutton milk. <laughs> yes, we're finished. Thank you. Very good, very good. Very spicy today. Today spicy, yes. A bit too spicy for her. Thank you. The sweetest lady in Colombo. <laughs> So, what is your review? I can talk now. Okay. So, the meal was very spicy but very satisfying. And on my opinion, it's like very comforting food. Like you eat with your hands, you eat all the sauces. You were comforted quite all right. <laughs> yeah, before I tried your mutton, devil mutton, seriously. Yeah, but this feeling, yeah, it's so comforting, so good. And Sri Lankan food is different, as I said. It was very nice experience trying Sri Lankan food for the first time. And yeah, now I'm in Colombo. If you have any recommendations about places, what to try, what to see, what to visit, uh, don't hesitate to write it in the comments. And yeah, it's just the beginning of our journey in Sri Lanka. Soon we will go to the beaches and the mountains, mountains, the rivers, the safari, everything, deserts, deserts yeah. Uh, so follow me on Instagram to see more and follow me here, of course, to explore the world.